If you have ever tried to install APK files on your Chromebook, you know you have got to enter developer mode, which requires a factory reset. Fortunately, there is a way to sideload APKs on a Chromebook without developer mode. We can accomplish this with the help of ADB on the Linux subsystem. So in this video, let's see how to do that. Step 1. Enable Linux subsystem. If you haven't already enabled the Linux subsystem, you'll need to do that now. Open Settings. From the left pane, choose Advanced. Then click on Developers. You can see the Linux Development Environment option here. Just turn it on. Click Next. Enter a username for your Linux system. Then choose the disk size for the Linux system. You can keep it at its default value which is 10 GB. If you want to install Linux apps and games, you can increase the disk size as well. Click on Install. The download and installation process starts. It can take a few minutes to complete. After installation, the Linux terminal window will automatically launch. You can close it for now. Then follow the next step to set up ADB. Step 2. Set up Android Debug Bridge ADB. After Linux has been installed, click on this arrow icon to open its preference page. Here, you should see an option called Develop Android Apps. But as you can see, I do not have this option here. To get this option, first I have to enable Google Play Store on my Chromebook. After enabling Play Store, you can see the Develop Android option is now available. Just click on it. Then click the Enable ADB Debugging Toggle to enable the feature. We are going to use this feature to sideload APK files. You will be asked to restart your Chromebook. Click on Restart and Continue. An ADB prompt will come after the reboot. Just click on Confirm. After your Chromebook has rebooted, open the terminal from the app drawer. Click Penguin and launch it. We need to install Android ADB tool on the Linux system. To do so, type sudo apt install adb. Hit enter. Press Y to confirm the installation. Our ADB setup is done. Now you can proceed to install any APK file you want on your Chromebook. Step 3. Install APK files. Just to show you, I am going to install this Firefox APK file. I'd suggest you rename your APK file to something shorter, just so you can easily type in on the terminal. Make sure to move the APK file into the Linux files folder, because the Linux system can see files only from this folder. Now, to install it, Open the terminal app again. On the terminal, enter the adb devices command. Check the box next to always allow from this computer. Then click OK. It should show that an emulator device is attached. Now, to install the app, type adb install then type the app name with the .apk extension. It will start installing the app. After that, open the app drawer and here you will find the Android app that you just installed. Please remember, the installed app is not running in the Linux container. It uses the Android runtime framework just like any other apps downloaded from Google Play Store. So the performance would be similar to other Android apps on your Chromebook. So that was our guide on how to sideload Android apps on Chromebook without developer mode. Once you set up the ABD, you just have to run these two simple ADB commands every time you want to install an APK. However, be careful when you are sideloading APKs. Some APKs may contain malicious code. So only download them from trusted sources. 
otherwise it is safer to stick to the apps available on Google Play Store instead